Frances Bean is continuing to mourn the loss of her father, musician Kurt Cobain. The 31-year-old takes to her Instagram April 5th to share a moving tribute to her late dad on the 30th anniversary of his death, writing, 30 years ago, my dad's life ended. In the last 30 years, my ideas around loss have been in a continuous state of metamorphizing. The biggest lesson learned through grieving for almost as long as I've been conscious is that it serves a purpose. The duality of life and death, pain and joy, yin and yang, need to exist alongside each other or none of this would have any meaning. The model also shares several throwback pics of herself and the Nirvana frontman saying, the second and third photo capture the last time we were together while he was still alive. I wish I could have known my dad. I wish I knew the cadence of his voice, how he liked his coffee, or the way it felt to be tucked in after a bedtime story. He gifted me a lesson in death that can only come through the lived experience of losing someone. It's the gift of knowing for certain when we love ourselves and those around us with compassion, with openness, with grace, the more meaningful our time here inherently becomes. Frances then posts a sweet home video of her dad playing with her as a baby. Fly. Want to fly? 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 <laughs> Nose. Tastes good. <laughs> Wanna barf in my mouth again? Three times the charm. <laughs> Are you getting all this? Yes. Oh, aren't we lucky? Oh, no. The Rock and Roll Hall of Famer married fellow musician Courtney Love in February 1992 and welcomed his only child, Francis, later that year. However, Kurt died in 1994 at the age of 27, when Francis was just a year old after taking his own life. The rock icon's daughter concludes her tribute by saying that she still feels her father's presence all around her and expressing her sympathy for others who have experienced a profound loss, writing, He is present in so many ways. In those moments, I get to spend a little time with my dad and he feels transcendent. To anyone who has wondered what it would have looked like to live alongside the people they have lost, I'm holding you in my thoughts today. The meaning of our grief is the same.